Good morning, students. This is your fourth class of chapter one. In this class, we are going to study about rounding of number nearest to ten, hundred, and thousand. So far, we have studied about number name, place value system, face value system, pattern. largest number smallest number but in this class we are going to study about rounding of numbers which is related to your let's practice 4 and let's practice 5 which is related to roman one let's start our let's practice 4 what is rounding rounding means making a number smaller or larger rounding means making a number smaller or larger when we round to the nearest tens we look at the ones place if the number is 5 or more we move up otherwise we move down let us look at example 1 121 nearest to 10 we have to round off this number to nearest to 10 will draw a number line and represent those numbers into a number line 120 121 122 123 24 125 126 127 128 129 100 and 30 what you can see 121 is closest to what 120 so you can write 121 is closest to 120 then 230 so it is rounded off to 120 which is the answer you will directly write 120 here you can read the rules these rules are also written in your exercise book in page number 16 and 17 let's read to round off a number to the nearest 10 observe the digit at one's place always for rounding of a number to the nearest 10 will observe at one's place you will see if the digit if the digit is less than 5 replace it with 0 if this digit is less than 5 will straight away replace it with 0 if the digit is equals to 5 or the digit is greater than 5 replace it with 0 and increase the digit at tens place by 1 if this digit is greater than 0 if it is 5 or 7 what you will do you will replace it with 0 and increase it with 1 Let, let's move to example number b 1011 we'll again draw a line and show them into a number line 1011 where does it lies it lies closest to 110 and this is what for checking the number in once a uh, tens uh, nearest to tens we will see the digit at ones place this is one which is less than 5 what we will do will replace it with 0 so it is closest to 111 then 220 so it is round off to 110 you will write 110 last example of nearest to 10 50555 you will replace the number into a number line 50555 is where does it lies it is neither less than 5 the digit in ones place is neither less than 5 nor more than 5 it is equal to 5 the rule apply, what does the rule says if the digit is equal to 5 increase the digit at tens place will increase the digit at tens place by 1 so it is round off to 50560 Will increase by one. How will it be? You will make it zero to the ones place and increase the digit to one. That is fifty thousand five hundred and sixty. Your answer is this. Now we'll do nearest to hundred. Example number one, one hundred and twenty-one. For nearest to hundred, you have to look at the digit of tens. We'll first read the rule. To round off the number to the nearest hundred, observe the digit at the tens place. if the digit is less than 5 the digit is less than 5 what we will do replace the tens and ones digit by 0 we'll straight away replace this number by 0 because as both the the tens digit is less than 5 suppose if the number would have been 
165. What will you have done? The number is more than 5. What we will do? If the digit is equal to 5 or it is greater than 5, replace the digit at the tens place and ones place by 0 and increase the digit at 100 place by 1. You will replace this two digit ones and tens by 0 and plus 1 in the 100 place. So 1061 will be 200 round off because we'll change the ones and tens place by 0 and make the 100 place to by adding 1, it will be 200. Let us move to an example number B. 1111. We will make a number line. Show where does it lies. Closer 2000 because we will see the tens place is less than 5. So, it will be closer to 1000. So, it is round off to 1000. Last sums. Nearest 200, 50,555. We'll again make a number line and represent the number. Now you can see the number is 5,550, uh, 50,555. The 10s and 1s number is equals to 5. We'll apply the rule number 2. What we will do? We'll make the 1s and 10s number 2, 0 and add 1s in the 100 place. So, before I tell you, tell me what will be the answer? 50,600. I will show you how. 50,555 is greater than 5, equal to 5 as the rule. So, replace the digit at the tens and ones place by zeros and increase the digit and 100 place by 1. So, 50,555 is round off to 50,600. This is the answer. Now we will do same thing as we have done in ones, tens. Now we will do thousands. As the first example is not valid for this because there is no thousand number. So it is already cross. We will do with the example 2. 1011. Now in which digit we will look? We will look at 100 digit. And change the number in 1000. Let's read the rule first. To round off a number to the nearest 1000, observe the digit at the 100 place. 100 plate is 0 which is less than 5. If the digit is less than 5, replace the digit at the 100 place. 100 tens and 1s by 0. We'll simply make it 0, 0, 0. You can see in the number line. I have make it easy by showing you in the number line. You can directly use your brains by applying the rules. I have done in both the way by showing it in the number line and applying the rules. You can see that the 100 place is 0 which is less than 5. So what you can do? You can directly make 1s, 10s and 100 place 0 and you write the answer. 1,111 is closer to 1,000 than 2,000. So, it is rounded off to 1,000, which is an answer. Example C, 50,555. You will again show it in the number line. 50,000 and 250,000, 51,000. 50,555, you will look at hundreds. Place value of 100. It is equals to 5. Which rule will be applied? Rule 2. If the digit is equals to 5 or the digit is greater than 5, replace the digit at the hundreds, tens and ones place by 0. And increase in which digit? Increase in thousand digit. Now the thousand digit is 0. What it will be? You will make 0, 0, 0, twin ones, tens and hundred and what you will write in thousand place? 1. What will be the answer? 51,000. The Two range which we are setting, we have to accept any of the one. 50,555 is greater than 5, equal to 5 as in the rule says, replace the digit at the 100, tens and 1's place by 0 and increase the digit at the 1000th place by 1. So, 50,555 is rounded off to 51,000. This is the answer. This way we can do our 
in this way we can solve our table easily i'll leave it to you you can draw a table and solve your sums or directly apply the rules 1 and 2 in year is to 10 year is to 100 and year is to 1000 children i am very clear with ones tens and hundred hope you are able to understand the concept now we will move to roman numbers roman numbers from 1 to 50 in the screen you can see the one side a hindu arabic numerals are written and the other side the roman numerals are written this we have already done in our assignment 1 you have to do it again in this assignment for a revision of your let's practice 5 very simple you just need to understand if you can learn and understand this you can do your further expanded form and fill in the blanks easily write the expanded form of the following roman numeral as hindu arabic numerals here the numbers are written in a roman numbers and you have to write an expanded form in an hindu arabic numerals it is written 4 so you write 5 minus 1 10 directly 10 13 Ten plus one plus one plus one. This is sixteen. Ten plus five plus one. This is twenty-four. Ten plus ten plus five minus one. Usually, we expand form using ten five with plus and minus, so that we can. It is easier and simple to understand. Let's move to the other question. That is, fill in the blanks using. greater than less than or equal to sign the numbers are given in hindu arabic numerals and here the numbers are given in roman numbers 7 6 which is greater 7 19 here the roman numbers also 19 and hindu arabic numbers also in 19 put an equals to sign 8 9 obviously 9 is greater 20 21 which is greater 21 here this will here we end our lesson hope children i am able to clear your concept related to rounding of numbers and roman number and you would be able to solve your assignment easily thank you children